tonight, Tampa's police union is sounding the alarm about officer safety, all because of the growing number of Super Bowl related events and big parties that are happening across the city. ABC Action News reporter Ryan Smith is digging into this tonight. Despite city officials urging fans to stay distant and mask up, crowds are still forming. And tonight, the police union states in this letter right here, many Super Bowl events are endangering the health of local officers. TPD on patrol risking their own health in the middle of a pandemic. When you're in a big crowd like this at the at the NFL uh, experience, you, you have no idea what's going on. Um, you have no idea who's got what. Tonight, the Tampa Police Benevolent Association is expressing its frustration after hearing concerns from officers in the field. It was enough for us to do this. In a letter to more than 1,000 active and retired officers, the union blames the NFL and local NFL host committee for adding more events and parties after the Bucks advanced to the big game. It reads in part, quite frankly, it is irresponsible and it alludes to putting dollars over officer lives and safety. But we are cops at the end of the day and we've got a job to do and we've got to show up and we've got to do it. Tonight, the host committee states any event that may have been added recently is not sanctioned by either the NFL or the host committee. And Tampa's police chief adds, having the Bucks in the Super Bowl has created a unique dynamic. Our officers have been supplied with the proper equipment and are required to wear it on assignment. We still stand with the community and we still love the Bucks and we still want it to go on, but we are just concerned and we've got to air those concerns as part as officer safety and public safety as well. And you can read this full letter online. We have it posted at abcactionnews.com. In downtown Tampa, Ryan Smith, ABC Action News.